and crime rate murder y'all that's what i'm really getting that's what i'm getting from all of this okay either she because in miss in i believe it was miss um miss uh, sheldon's reading somebody was a snitch somebody talked too much okay and that's what i'm getting right here somebody talked too damn much and that that was a burden because a nine of swords is also a burden that was a burden and they weren't from the same family or bloodline or whatever organization or whatever the hell y'all you know and they, they they plotted to abandon abandon this girl why i say they plotted because the seven of pentacles is about planning working together your hard work paying off fruits of your labor they plotted this he was one of the main planners how he felt about this he was one of the main planners allegedly you guys okay so we're going to move over here to the whoop, the hair effect this is how the problem affected him look at those fives Mm, the hair fit. That's how the problem affected him. You guys are going to end it here and come right back. All right, you guys are back with the hair fit here. Um, you remember those three keys we was talking about in the other people's readings? If you are the ones that have been following the whole thing and watching the readings, okay? The hair fit here is what I was feeling like representing in everyone else's reading before I get into the traditional meaning. I was feeling like the Hierophant was one of the people that had most, the highest involvement, okay? One of the people that had one of the highest involvement here, okay? And I feel as though, because the position, this card is coming out in, you know, it is in the position of how the problem affected Mr. Nesbitt. This was almost like being able to rise up in some type of religion or organization or community or um yeah this was some type of opportunity here all of this because let me get it the page of cups is also about offering opportunity offering something giving up giving something i feel as though y'all this was an opportunity this whole thing right off of here was an opportunity to raise up higher in something okay and also seek some type of revenge in something towards this girl because i don't know what type of problem home skillet had with her but it, I, I was getting heavy vibes of he there was some type of problem like i don't know why you got a man that don't like a feet especially a young woman but there was some it was something y'all okay and here i feel as though this was an opportunity to rise up to be one of these other higher up people that were also are allegedly also had some involvement in this situation with miss jenkins you guys because i am I, when i say i get the strong vibe of yeah we got you know allegedly Teresa, you know the money for the friends um james carl but there are some other people and in a hotel y'all but y'all i'm telling y'all there are some other people <laughs> that 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 had some type of gain out of this too it was just too much green involved it was too much money too much work involved here okay and i feel like once he got it he, he rose up somewhere okay in some type of organization some type of religion something we'll end it here and get a clarifier you guys and come right back clarifying the her the next question was was her mother paid to keep quiet or was she threatened mm. was her mother paid to keep quiet or was she threatened come through spirit was her mother paid to keep quiet spirit was she threatened show us the energy around her mother what's this hmm. yes it's a deception around her mother you know I'm going to let y'all put that together though because this ain't Patreon I can't really say what I want to say the hermit somebody watching Somebody looking, somebody trying to control the situation, somebody reading the comments, reading what everybody's saying. Plan, heal, plan. <clears throat> A selfish game. Blinded, sacrifice, ritualistic. A decision had to be made.
Carl coming back. So you know how they switch these cameras and stuff around. You know damn well they did not pass each other and did not see each other. Now watch James come in the door. Teresa's man. Kanika's stepfather. Now what he got in the bag? A gift? Some food? Money? Where you going? So that was James. Pay attention to who's sitting in the lobby. You see how they got their faces blurred out, even the people in the lobby. And look who's coming back in. Ding! Thank you. 